This video was made to review and critique the material in it and is not intended to be a substitute for the original work. I do not own the material or any part of the series in this video. Please support Lead Them Films by watching the full episode and show on Crunchyroll, Netflix or any other platform that legally streams it. Links to the official sites are available in the description box below. This video is intended to fall under the general guidelines of fair use and is edited as to not compete with the original work. As an aspiring writer and artist, my goal is to comment, review, critique and learn from the work. Thank you for understanding. Welcome to Watcher, it's time for episode 3 of Tokyo Revengers. First of all, thank you so much for the support and for joining me on this adventure. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and leave a like if you enjoy the content. I truly appreciate that. So, the king versus the slave. How will this go? Badly is what I predict. Yet some good has to come out of it. I have a feeling that Hanagaki will gain respect after this fight. Maybe he'll put up a good fight. Maybe even the so-called king will be impressed himself. Storytelling wise, I feel like that is where we are heading. Unless someone else spots Hanagaki and finds him interesting. But this has to be how he comes a step closer to meeting one of those two important characters. Another thing. Hanagaki must be backing himself if he's stepping up to the bully. Maybe he's strong, just not brave. Can't wait to see how this goes, but much respect for helping out his friend. Pretty much rescuing him from a beatdown. Anyway, let's watch the episode. Alright, here we go. Man, you might get killed. Although I don't believe so, because this is your story pretty much. He looks angry. Ooh. Is that all you've got? This is a beatdown. Dude! He is enjoying himself, obviously. Yeah, tap out if you ain't got anything up your sleeve. Give him that. A bit overboard, but alright. No! No, no, don't. Whatever you do, don't. Have they had enough? Or? Is something happening? He was holding on to him. Is that the strategy? Tire him out? Persistent. Let's see what you've got then. They're like, what is he talking about? 12 years? If I was the other guy, I wouldn't have let him speak. Put up the pressure. But maybe he's tired. The other guy. What was his name? Kiyomasa. And this guy is dangerous. He was contemplating something very dangerous. Ooh. A bat? That ain't fair though. Shouldn't this be fist to fist? Yeah, exactly. Who's speaking? One of the cool guys from the opening. The vice commander of the Tokyo Manji Gang. Ryugu Jiken. Draken. Draken, Draken, Draken. Okay, I'll try to remember that. Alright, these guys are serious. Or maybe one of them. But I would not underestimate the other one. Commander Sano. So this little guy is the head. Mikey, Mikey and Draken. And why did he do that? Good question. He wasn't the king, obviously. Takemichi? Is he alright, this guy? Imagine hearing someone say that. Oh my god, he is... Yeah, something is off with this little guy. He is cold-blooded. But man, cool characters. Okay, so almost as I expected. Not quite. Okay, should we call him Takemichi from now on? Or should I keep calling him Hanagaki? We'll see. Yeah, we saw that. I'm glad you didn't do it. Yeah, all it takes... Is to stand up for yourself, as I said. And here he is. Who's cooler, Mikey or Draken? I don't know, Draken is quite cool. I like his character design. But Mikey is also a bit unexpected. <laughs> what the hell are they doing? They apparently live for fighting. I can't say that I am surprised. Imagine the respect after this. When people see that he's friends with Mikey and Draken. No, it's not like that. Mm, you shouldn't interfere. She is ready to fight. Uh-oh. 
I don't think it is like that, Hina. Takemichi, you need to say something. Actually, a good question. Ooh. She was stepping up for you. You need to step up for her now. It is what it is. I am really enjoying this episode. And here he is. The unpredictable animal. Man, I don't think we'll ever be able to understand this guy or predict his moves. They actually respect that. I think he's used to worse though. I can't really tell if these guys are good or if they are trouble. They seem good, but dangerous. Yeah, what happened? What will go wrong? Is it? I was about to say that's a good question. Not a dumb one. Okay. What? Okay. He answered my inner question. Maybe you should stay by his side, Hanagaki. Yeah, there must be something more to that story or to that incident. And who the hell is that? Was that the other guy maybe? I think that might be the other one. Because you probably have seen him on that picture. Well, this was quite an awesome episode. Easily the best episode by quite a lot. And Mikey and Draken are the main reason for that, obviously. Anyway. As I suspected in the intro, someone would be impressed or at least intrigued by Takemichi, but I never thought that it would be one of the important characters. It looks like Hanagaki will be staying by Mikey's side and not that rival dude. This probably means that the teams have been established, we have our group of protagonists and we know who the antagonists are gonna be. Things might change yet though, so it's not fully settled. Anyway, a lot of character development and progression. Takemichi is stepping up for real, standing up for Hina who also stood up for him. Even though both were pretty scared, Hanagaki should probably be the MVP of this episode. But I just have to give it to Mikey and Draken. Great introduction to two cool characters. My favorite moment of this episode was easily when Mikey and Draken ended the fight. The first time we saw them. I think that was done really well. I expected something like this. Yet, I was still surprised, so I have to give this episode a 9 out of 10. Things just got so much more epic. This episode had everything. I haven't figured out what will go wrong yet though. Mikey seems like a nice guy, but we know that something will lead to a dangerous war, and I believe that there must be more to that incident, and we'll probably learn about it as the story progresses. But anyway guys, that's it for this time. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, then please subscribe and leave a like. I'd really appreciate that. Now take care and see you next time.